What's up, ladies and gentlemen? It's me, Tom Hawks, and today I wanted to discuss the most annoying phrase I've heard in my lifetime. And the phrase goes, you know, high school is going to be the best four years of your life. Oh, man. You remember back in high school? Wow, that was the best four years of my life. You're going to have a great time. Oh, geez. Get ready for high school. That's going to be the best time. Get as much as you can after it. Because after high school, it sucks. You know what? If high school is supposed to be the best four years of my life, why am I even bothering now? And I think the funny thing is, after I got to college, I heard multiple times in my first year of college, you know, college is going to be the best four years of your life, Tom. The best four years. I hate that phrase. I hate it. And I know school just started, so I know there's a bunch of freshmen going to high school right now being told that. High school are the best four years of your life. And it, it, it's supposed to be encouraging, I guess. Wow, we're going to have a jolly old time. Well, I can't wait. But it's so demotivating for me. Just knowing that everybody about, like, because I look at the people that tell me, it's always like, for, for example, my dad was the first person. I'll just, you, for this video, I'll just talk about my dad. Because we had a heated argument about this a few nights ago when he was drunk off his ass. But the first thing my dad told me when we, we, when we were talking about me going to high school, when before I was a freshman, like the start of my freshman year before him, but he goes, you know, high school are going to be the, high school is going to be the best four, four years of your life. And I was like, woohoo, yeah, let's go, let's go. But then I got sad in it. I got sad about it. And I was talking to this about my dad a, a few nights ago, and I said, Dad, I don't want high school to be the best four years of my life. I want to do something more. I want to do something greater. I want to do something wonderful. I want to follow my dreams and be who I, who I want to be. And this dude, oh my God, my dad got mad at me. He said, what do you mean the high school isn't the best four years? They're going to be the best four years of your life. Those are the best four years. You won't get nothing like that. And then he starts talking about his Navy career. I was in the Navy for 23 years. And those, that was a wonderful time in my life. That's, and that probably was the only 23 years that equaled the four years of high school I did. You don't understand. You're not going to have those 23 years in the Navy. You're not going to have that. You're not going to enjoy that moment. You're going to have high school, which is going to be the best four years. And I said, Dad, what's the point? I'm not going to let that be the best for years. That can't be the best for years. No, you don't understand. It so it just goes on like that. My dad's a dick sometimes. But I just, I don't understand how people live like that. Like my dad, my, how does my dad have me, my sister, you know, he's got, I, I got a half sister, which is also his. I got a stepbrother, but his, that's, that's his. You know, he's on his third wife. He's traveled the world, you know, and he's in the Navy. He was super successful. He's done all these things and he has all these experiences and memories. And I think he's 53, 54 years old now. How does he tell me high school will be the best four years? If he's done all that, all of those things, and he's still telling me high school will be the best four years. It's so demotivating. Like, aren't parents supposed to motivate you to be greater? And it's the teachers, too. They tell you high school will be the best four years of your life. No, it can't be. It, I refuse to believe that. And it sucks. I, I, I want to, ah, I just want to tell all of you that you can do greater things. But I just know you're going to be brainwashed. Ah, you can do something greater, Okay. I went to college and I dropped out because I want to do something more. I, I want to be something special in this world, you know? Because, I mean, they, they tell you that too, you know? Oh, everybody's special and you know, blah, blah, blah. But uh, I have a lot to talk about. I'm going to talk about it in later videos. But right now, I just wanted to rant about that best four years of your life because... It's been on my mind a lot lately with school starting and that argument with my dad. It's oh God. just be happy. Don't let high school be the best four years of your life. Enjoy it. Enjoy the shit out of it. Don't take it too seriously because it's it's only four years. You know, take it serious enough. If, if, if you want to be a doctor, yeah, you might want to grind your ass off. 
but I graduated with a 2.43. I went to college for a year, and I, I had above a 3.0 there, I believe, when I went. Because I, I, did, I did pretty well, but I dropped out just because that's not what I want to do. Just be happy. That's the point. Just be happy. Do what you want to do. And don't stress so much about what comes after high school. Because I can assure you, if, if you're as hungry as I am for life and for happiness, you will not let high school be the best four years of your life. Anyone who tells you those are the best four years, it's because they didn't follow their dreams.